now let's go back to the templates area and here you can see the blog home the blog home is the blog page if i go to the blog you can see it looks like this so we are going to create our blog home page go back to the templates and click on blog home so we can create this layouts from scratch or we can simply go to the all archive and copy all archive templates just copy and go to blog home remove the group and then not before it should be after and type here page header first add page header and then add our copy template and instead archive type for blog home template you have to add a static text here it's very important to understand so we are gonna use block static text not dynamic text and change it to the h1 remove this remaining text and change the color to the white color click save and now if i reload our blog page it will display our new layouts here and click read more it will take us to the blog single page now inside the blog archive or blog home you can change the previous and next pagination so currently if i navigate to the blog you can see here there is no pagination and it's displaying a nine pages or nine posts here so let's click on pagination let's make it a little bit nicer here after clicking over here it will create some space between these items add a spacer at the top and type here like when there is no blog post found it will display this text there is no posts found and select previous post and add here next post and also select the pagination from here and change it to the arrow so it will add or display arrow before the previous post text and next post text after and you can also change this number of links let's make it two or three whatever you want you can change it from here and now right now it's not displaying because we have a number of posts which is displaying here all the posts together so i'm going to navigate to the settings and reading and change the blog post show to five that means after displaying five blog posts it will display the pagination here so as you can see the pagination is displaying if i go to the next post it will looks like this and it will display the previous post as well now below this blog post area let's add in other sections CTA so we just added CTA here and as you remember we haven't added CTA for other templates it's completely up to you how you want your websites looks like you can change them as per your requirements so I hope you understand how the blog archive and how the blog page design and if your client has different layout or different request you can change them you can create a beautiful blog page layouts like we did here on the home page so you can literally change any kind of layouts so there will be some other tutorials where I'll be displaying a series of these uh, specific sections hopefully it will be really helpful for all of you